sitting at the heart of this issue is starvation and malnutrition. And I don't think any of us can really imagine what it is to go hungry. So I wanted to better understand what effect on the body this really has. I met with nutritionist Joe Travers, who helped to explain it all. We've just heard from one family who, whose daily diet consists of rice, maybe some dal, and that's it. Mm -hmm. What happens to the body if that's all it's fueled by over a period of time? In the short term, protein energy malnutrition can lead to weight loss, so low weight for your height. But in the long term, that can lead to poor cognitive development and poor physical development in children. This can lead on to poor educational attainment and also because their physical development is affected, it can have an effect on how their ability to carry out physical labour and that has an impact on their capacity to earn money and from that you get this cycle so they have less money to spend on good nutrition, their children don't learn as well because they've got poor cognitive development and the cycle continues and continues through generations. Practical Action have set up a soup kitchen at Spitalfields Market in London and I'm going to go and get myself as involved as I can to find out more from the staff about their experiences and well, to try and make myself useful.